So once we insert our SD card into our computer, we should see this icon. If that icon doesn't pop up, just go into your finder and you should see it right here on devices, okay? If you don't, don't worry, we just have to format it. And as a matter of fact, I always, always recommend formatting anyways, okay? So this is how to do it on Mac. On Windows, you would just right click and then you would have the option to format, okay? On um, Mac, it's a little bit different, so we're just gonna go to Disk Utility. So just look for Disk Utility. Every Mac has it, it's not a program that you download. It's uh, pre-built to your Mac, okay? And this is what we use to format any SD drive, um, any USB drive as well. So right here, we're gonna see this card, okay? So what we can do is click on any of these two, and we're gonna see what it's formatted as. So it's right now it's MS-DOS FAT32, which is fine. This will work right away on your Mac and should work on any camera. Okay, now on Mac, if we click on erase, we're gonna see that option. We're also gonna see XFAT. I usually do recommend formatting everything as XFAT. However, this time we're just gonna do MS-DOS FAT since it's just gonna be used for camera. Okay, so take pictures and everything's gonna go in that card. Now when you're formatting like this, you will erase everything from it. Okay, so if you have pictures on it or anything like that, this is not the time to format it. You want to back those pictures up and then you want to format, okay? So, um, to format it, all we have to do is choose our thing. Um, just in case, if you guys choose any of these other ones, these other options are just for Mac. So they will not be read on PC and most cameras will not be able to read your card, okay? So you do need to pick one of these two. Um, like I said, I usually recommend XFAT, but this time we're just gonna do MS-DOS FAT. Okay, so we just click on erase next. Okay, um, we're just gonna click erase again. And that's it, we just formatted our card. Now, I would suggest putting a name for it. So I'm just gonna put a 16 gig SD, that's all. Um, you can call it whatever you want. Once you're done that, you can just close this. Okay, now if you didn't rename it when you were formatted it, don't worry, um, you can just click on this, go and, well, let me just show you, you can right click on this and you can just rename it, okay, or what you guys can do is just click on it once, press the enter or return key, erase that, and then just type in, well, let's type in 16 gig SD, and that's about it. So right now, you could put music on it, pictures, whatever you want, or you can just insert in your camera and start taking some pictures. So that's about it for this tutorial. If you guys have any questions, comments, you can please write them here below. And don't forget to subscribe and rate. Thank you.